Hey YouTubers, this is Zach with Dream Media Home Theater. Today we're going to be installing another theater room here in Carrollton. We're going to be putting in a 120 inch screen for Dragonfly and a uh, Epson 4050, which you've seen we've been using a lot recently, and we're doing a 5.1.2 flip system. We're using the uh, professional series in the front left and right, and then overhead for our Atmos, we're using the designer series, and then in the rear of the room, we're going to be using the designer series. And then we're going to have a uh, SPL 100 subwoofer here in the rear of the room, and everything is going to be terminating back here in the closet. Oh, and for our center speaker, we're using the uh, reference premiere. Um, uh, the 640 uh, on-wall designer series speaker. And then back here is where our rack is going to be. For amplification, we are using the Denon in Command series, the 2500H. And uh, we're going to use that rack mount um, light kit with the surge protection in it. We're doing a strong FS series rack, which is going right here. And you can see everything's pre-wired for us, so we're ready to rock and roll. I'll upload the video after we complete the work. Hey everybody, this is Zach with Dream Media Home Theater. We just finished up another awesome home theater project here in Carrollton. I wanted to show off to you today. We have a 120 inch ultra white 4K screen with the uh, Home Cinema 4050 from Epson. And we're using a Klipsch uh, Professional Series 5.1.2 in wall surround system with the reference Premier 640 here at the front. I want to show you these in walls. You can see the finished product is very clean. Some people like the grills to be off. Um, in this case, we're leaving them on. They are magnetic and they have rotatable tweeters to position your audio directionally toward your target seating area. And then you can see the same situation here with the center speaker. You got your six, three and a half inch woofers, ceramic metallic woofers, and that 90 by 90 horn. And then over here, same thing. Except for this is a six inch and the 90 by 90 horn. Overhead, we use the designer series for our Atmos effects. And then at the rear of the room, designer series in walls for our rears. And then our one subwoofer, and this is the SPL series. They got that nice big magnet on the back, 10 inch sub, the SPL 100. And then last but not least, our rack, which is back here in the closet. And we use the strong FS series, 15 U rack. And this has a lock on it, so you can uh, lock it up keep the kids out of there. Nice uh, glass door on here, all the side panels to keep all the wiring hidden. And um, we have our tube lights with the watt box surge protector here to make sure everything is uh, filtering out the noise as well as protect them from lightning strikes. And uh, I just like the tube lights because they look nice. And then, and they can be folded in as well if you don't like the look of that, as well as uh, dim them or just turn them off. 
Um, and then we're using the Denon 2500 in command series to power the whole system up. We also have our Xbox One, a Apple TV 4K, and then the remote processor. So we're using the Pro Control system, and this is the ProLink R with the Pro 24R. And that's so that everything can be in here, hidden, out of sight, and we'll be able to control it all through radio frequency. Very nice little system. Customers happy, I'm happy. Um, if you guys would like to purchase this product, just give us a call or shoot us an email. Make sure to subscribe down below. Thank you for watching. This is Zach with Dream Media Home Theater.